Hi guys. Uh, today I'm going to be sharing with you the story of my life. Yeah. <laughs> Not exactly, but I'm going to be talking about why I cut my hair and the journey. I'm sure I would love to know because my hair was actually a little long let me say not that long sure yeah, but just it was just a little long before i go into that let me especially welcome you to today's episode yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. guys welcome back to Brazil empire youtube channel it's my pleasure having you again if you are new on this channel you're highly highly welcome please take the front seats it's reserved for you enjoy yourself so guys the last time I cut my hair was when I was in GSS 1 or 2, thereabouts. And ever since then, I did not cut my hair. Not until a month ago. Yeah, it should be a month now. A month ago, or close to a month. Three weeks and above, if I'm not wrong. That I cut this beautiful hair you are seeing. Beautiful, isn't it? <laughs> yes. Even if you say it's not beautiful. It's beautiful for me. Yoruba will say, Omani na nani. Apologies to you if you don't understand Yoruba. But I would like to translate that in English. Uh, you cherish what you have, Sha. In a nutshell. So, this air, hmm. You know, the reason why I cut my hair actually was because I just felt like it, to be sincere. I've always had this um, urge to just do it. Like, just close your eyes and do it. But then I've always been like, ah, I will like my now. What will people say? My friends, families, and like that. And the thing is, hmm, you know, sometimes when you talk about, I don't know if that's applicable to you. But then sometimes when I talk about cutting a, you know, you have people around that will be like, eh, if you cut your hair, don't talk to me again, no. <laughs> like that. Yeah. So I had, um, no, no, no. I had like I still have them though. I have them like that around so i my thoughts about cutting the air i'll be like ah she's supposed to be like it she's supposed to be like it but recently after i got married congratulations to me i got married the love of my life let's say three weeks ago no up to a month now don't mind me out time flies february 24th thank you so much for the wishes i uploaded a video of um, our wedding and the short story short love story on my channel i'm going to put up the link so that you can watch and enjoy so back to our story i told my husband that babe i want to cut my hair <laughs> like i was literally tired of the air going to the salon sitting for long hours i'm sure ladies can relate like ah oh, it was really so tiring like really tiring and to cry it all i did not have the time to make air like that. Most times I'll go to the salon in the evening and before I finish with the air late in the night, I was just so annoyed of all of those stress. And then you know the funniest part? Hmm. Is it a hair dryer? Uh -huh. It's called hair dryer now. That one that will that will be connected to light that will be that will put your hair so that the your hair can dry. Is hair dryer? My brother, my sisters, that's it. Hey! I'll call it so fired. That thing is always too odd for me. Like, really too odd. So, all this is just together. I said, nah, 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 nah. I can't do this no more. <laughs> I chose this. And I then told my husband. So, he was, you know what he did? Hmm. Man, eh? It's only God that will help you. What he did was that he said his hand is not in this matter. If you like, cut your hair. If you like, don't cut your hair. But if you decide that you want to cut your hair, let's sign an agreement later. <laughs> I like, I wanted to post it to laughter. That, Are you kidding me right now? So, why uh, so that people will not be like, uh, your husband forced you to cut your hair uh, because this and this and that. So, when you got married, that was when your husband now mandated it for you that you baby must cut your hair. I said, no, no, it's not like that. Well, long story cut short. I didn't sign any paper like <laughs> but good for me because later now i can hold it i can hold it to his neck that yes he said it. that was on a lighter note sure 
it didn't force me to cut my hair i just wished to cut that hair and you can see the transition from this hair you are seeing on your screen to this one like that you are seeing on your screen <laughs> one person two looks so that is it so i'm going to be showing you uh the journey when i got to the salon when i was about cutting the hair you know my husband followed me to the place he, he wanted to make sure that even if i want to cut my hair then i must cut something that is okay now that i'll go to the salon now come back home in the evening or in the night or whatever time of the day and then come back with one hair that is all looking fine <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how it should be, but he made the videos and I'm going to be putting it up on the screen so that you guys can follow. But you know what I want from you guys now? I want you to tell me if this my look is looking appealing, if you like it, and or rather if you don't like it, please let me know so that I will know how to start, you know, do your is that Jacolo Kolo they call it in Yoruba now? Or this small small so that i will start doing my jagunu kolo and grow my hair <laughs> but let me do a disclaimer right here now yeah, before you start dropping your comments let me do a disclaimer the disclaimer is that you see this hair that you see right now this is like one month old three and a half weeks thereabouts or close to a month old so please do your judgment wisely now i'm going to be showing you the videos and the pictures of when i was doing justice to this beautiful amazing eh if you are not fine after baby i'm going to collect back all the bright price and everything to go by <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, it will grow back. It's just a matter of time. I want to have a new look, so I'm going to my hair. <laughs> are you done? Okay, I guess you're done. Yeah, so that's it. That's it though. That's what I want to share with you guys. Ah, it's been a journey. You know the funniest thing? I've not posted my picture ever since I got here because I want you guys to see it first and tell me what you feel before I start flying the pictures all around social media. <laughs> okay. So thank you very much for sticking around. Thank you for watching this video. I love you so much. I had you big. Is this how they do it? Is it how they do it? I don't know how they do it, but just know that I love you so much, guys. Thank you very much for staying. See you next time.